Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Lebo, but you will simply know me as Al of Through Al's Eyes. I'm so excited to share this video with you guys because my friend and I visited Bali to celebrate our 30th birthday and we found hidden gems and treasures in the regions of Legian, Seminyak and Qatar. And these were areas that we visited frequently because we were staying in Legian. So I thought I should share these with you should you consider visiting Bali anytime soon. So my friend and I have been on a quest to find really cool places that you can go to when in Bali and upon researching which are the must go to places to eat is a place called Azul Beach Club. It's near Padma Beach and it's at the Bali Mandira Beach Resort and Spa. Let me just show you what the place looks like and hopefully she and I will eat there because we're looking to go have some din din there sometime but it looks amazing from the outside. This is how it looks. You can tell that it's quite a huge attraction, you know, because when people stand by the side, they just take pictures, and when they spot it, they want to take videos like I'm doing right now, or, you know, family photos of themselves just near the structure. So, Azul Beach Hotel looks great from the outside. I hope that I can give you a review of the food and the vibe about it from the side. It's a very quaint restaurant on Padma, I'd like to think it's Padma Street, but it's where the Padma Legian Hotel is. It's called Mama Marici. It's an Italian inspired uh, Italian inspired kitchen. Oh my gosh, what's the restaurant? But I just wanted to show you guys this. So I'm trying out things that I've never had before. And lo and behold, I got myself a Fanta strawberry. We don't have this in South Africa. I'm not lying, guys. There it is. I really hope it tastes great and the food here is reasonably priced so we got ourselves a pasta and I will show that to you once our order comes. We asked to food outside because it's absolutely wonderful. I mean it's hot, it's warm weather throughout the day and night in Bali and we thought with the perfect view such as this one, can't let it go to waste. So our food arrived and it looks absolutely amazing. My friend over there is having a napo. A what? Marinara. <laughs> so it's a mix of tiger prawn, calamari, clams, shrimp and white sauce and she's having it with fettuccine. On my side I am having an amatricana. It is bacon, onion, chili flakes and tomatoes with penne pasta and it looks absolutely divine so we're about to take a taste. If there's anything that you have to do while in Bali, I should definitely try a traditional Balinese dish. For me, I'm having a steamed rice with chicken mixed with a whole lot of herbs. I forgot the name of the dish but I know this is sambal because it's spicy. Fla chili flakes with green chili and a whole lot of other spices and then I'm having some bintang that's something new for me I don't drink beer at all but I think this is kind of it's like root beer so there's it's a mix of beer and lemon and it's very popular around here my friend on the other hand is having some Alfredo pasta with a daiquiri but yeah, the food here is really, really good. I love the place it's called Giant. Let me show you. It's called Giant Bar and Kitchen. Hey guys, so my friend and I are trying the meanest hot dogs and burgers in Seminyak. It has, it's at a place called Five Monkeys. There's the logo. 
They've got quite an assortment of offerings that they have. Your cheeseburgers, double cheeseburger, chili dog, Philly cheesesteak, nachos, chili cheese fries. But here's what I choose to go with. I'm having the chili hot dog with fries, ketchup, chili sauce, and my friend is having. What are you having, Tom? Cheeseburger mm -hmm. with fries. And we chose and to pair it with a Coke. <laughs> so, if you ever visit Bali and you're very close to Seminyak, do come through at the Five Monkeys. Oh my gosh you guys I have never been so excited like I said I'm like a kid in a candy store this is so versatile and innovative over 120 pictures and they were all so awesome I would definitely recommend DMZ 3D and Art Trick Center or Museum to anybody who will be visiting Bali anytime soon I definitely definitely enjoyed myself there we go if you didn't know now you know 